The way we build has not significantly changed since the time of the Romans. We build piece by piece, additively. Our buildings are made up of small components that we piece together. And what is the consequence of that? Well, one consequence is that our buildings are unsafe. The first thing we should be asking of our shelters is safety. Yet in high winds, all those pieces come apart. And because those pieces are also very flammable, our buildings, together with all the precious things we put inside them, burn in fires. Sadly, natural disasters are getting ever more frequent and ever stronger. And the shelters we depend on for safety of ourselves and our belongings and our families are simply no longer safe enough. Another issue with the additive way we build is that our building envelopes leak energy. Buildings use more energy than any other sector because of the thermal bridges or energy leaks in our piece together building envelopes. Buildings today use a staggering 40% of our energy and account for 50% of climate change. We think of ourselves as savvy consumers, and yet we spend one-third of our income on shelters that are so polluting and so unsafe. We must rethink the way we build and redesign the way we design. We must look to nature for a better way of building. Nature uses form-finding to develop the beautiful and the practical. Form finding is a logical process that's inspired by nature and aims to achieve forms that are optimal for stability, adaptability, and sustainability. And if we look at nature, we must look at how it shelters its most valuable assets. Nature depends on its next generation to survive. And across species, nature has developed the egg to shelter its babies its most valuable assets. So let's look at the egg, not only how it works, but also how it's made. Eggs are literally pumped with fluids to find their form and achieve their structural efficiency. Then shells are created around the yolk through a combination of calcium carbonate and crystals of calcite on the outer shell membrane. The result is genius. The egg is a monolithic, thin-shell, dual-curvature structure that transfers loads perfectly. A single raw egg can support 90 pounds of load. By contrast, if you take the same material that makes up an egg shell and the same internal volume, but arrange it in a box, it won't even hold up a single pound of load. The right angle of a box is the least efficient way of transferring loads, and that's why there are no right angles in nature. And yet, it is these right angles and boxes that we choose to shelter in. We literally surround ourselves with boxes. These inefficient forms are everywhere you look. At Beanie Shells, we design and build better. We use pneumatic formworks that are inflated like the egg. Once inflated, we add reinforcement and then a low carbon concrete to the inflated formwork or pneumoform. Once the concrete is cured, we deflate the pneumoform to leave a highly effective building envelope. No columns or shear walls are necessary, allowing total freedom in designing and redesigning the interior. Less material is used, about half of what is required in traditional construction, and yet the structural envelope is far safer. Like an egg, our shells are monolithic and dual curvature. They transfer loads as efficiently as is possible along the entire perimeter of the dome and perform far more efficiently in earthquakes. Since they are monolithic and aerodynamic, they do not fall apart in high winds but rather allow wind or floodwaters to pass smoothly around them. They're also built of non-combustible material and therefore cannot burn. From an environmental standpoint, they perform far better than traditional structures because they are built of a single material. This material is of the same thickness, starting at the foundations, going to the walls, to the roof, and back to the foundations, with no connections and therefore no thermal bridges or leaks. 
Once insulated to conform to the local weather, they achieve the highest standards of energy efficiency. And they are sculptural. Some have called them sculptures for living. They emerge and blend from the natural landscape and create unique interior environments that feel comfortable and make us feel at home. Learn more about our natural way of designing and building, which we call form-finding functionality, at beanieshoals.com.